Okay, guys, today we're going to teach you about muscle mass, and the topic is going to be understanding muscle mass, the key to forever weight loss. The trick is to establish a an increase in your, your basal metabolic rate, your metabolism, so that you burn more calories when you're not exercising, which is the greatest situation when it comes to working out, because if I can burn a few calories while I exercise, which is really negligible, but I can improve my muscle mass so that I can burn calories that other 23 and a half hours a day. There's just no comparison to the impact that that can have. So today your job is going to be to, in layman's terms, describe to us how we are gaining lean muscle and what that does to our metabolism. Okay. When you gain lean muscle, which you need to do, don't worry about too, getting too big. Don't worry about looking, you know, nasty, you know, hey, like you're from, like you're from Mars. Mars. Go ahead. Before you get going, let me just say something. Yeah. Guys, if for any reason you have what he just said in your mind, that you're going to get too bulky, uh, you're going to have too many muscles. Nobody has ever woken up one day and looked in the mirror and said, oh my gosh, I'm too muscular. Never. And if you're not taking illegal drugs, you do not have to worry about getting too vascular, getting too thick, growing too many muscles. If your guys having the excess acne and the things that this is not stuff that happens to regular people ever. Just so we're clear, every body looks better with more lean muscle and less body fat. And that's our goal. Sorry about that, D. Go ahead. No, that's that's exactly right. When you the, mu, first of all, muscle is the most metabolically active tissue in the body, which means it's the tissue that burns more calories than any other tissue in your body. It it does, and so we want to add more of that to our body. Secondly, when you add muscle, you need to stop worrying about what you weigh on the scale. I know that for some of you, that is very difficult to hear. Let me say it again. It's like it's running your fingers down a chalkboard. We don't have chalkboards anymore. Um, I need to get a new analogy. <laughs> I'm dating myself. But I know that drives some people crazy. But here's the deal. What you need to do is put on as much muscle as possible because it's the most metabolically active tissue that you can add to your body. When you do that, when you do that, you need to think inches and you need to think now the weight will fall, the weight will drop, but you need to think inches and body fat percentage. When you add more muscle, even if you don't lose any fat, even if you don't lose any fat that you previously had, your body fat percentage is going to go down because your proportions are changing. You're adding more muscle to your structure, to your system. As a result, your body fat is going to go down, not only because of that, but also because now you're a much more metabolically active person just sitting around. So the idea, and I heard a doctor say this just the other day, one of our mentors that we follow, and they said that it's there's coming a day when how muscular you are is going to be more of an indicator of your health than how fat you are. Right. So if you're very muscular, but still had a little body fat, okay. But if you have a, bunch, a lot of body fat and you've lost all of your muscle mass, this is not a good place to be. So the reason why we say that muscle mass is the key to forever weight loss is the more muscle you have, the faster the metabolism, the more calories you burn when you're not in the gym and you never need, uh, if you can establish the right meal plan, which is included with our system. It's not hard. It's super food oriented. Everything is healthy. It balances out the correct caloric deficit with the right nutrients and the right amount of protein and carbs to give you the perfect plan. So when you couple that with a solid strength training and then some of our interval based stuff for that extra bit of conditioning and that little kick up, you've got the perfect forever program. So you don't have to keep going back and looking up a new program. Well, I need to change it up. I need to change it up. I need something different. And here's the analogy we're going to use for that. Everybody brushes their teeth with a toothbrush, right? And it's not a fancy thing. It's 
up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. It's 14th, it's 14th century technology. Yeah, the same thing. Yeah. I think it's 1451. Yeah. So 15th century technology, yeah. yeah. The, the, you brush your teeth, okay? It's not fancy, but it prevents cavities, prevents expensive dental bills. Your teeth look lighter. You got fresh breath. It's simple. Nobody ever goes, you know, I'm getting tired of brushing my teeth. I think I'll change it up. I'm going to start brushing my teeth with a sock. Well, it's not going to be as effective. You can change it up if you want because you're bored, but that's not a very smart move because logically we have the optimal way to keep the teeth clean. This is how Project 49 views exercise. We have the optimal way scientifically, physiologically to build lean muscle. Why would we want to change it up for? You, you, you don't get caught up in that way of thinking. You need a system. This is that system, you follow the plan. You don't change it up because, oh, you know, I think I'll try that over there for a while. It, it doesn't work that way. So the, the gaining of the lean muscle through the Project 49 system is the secret to forever weight loss because once you've established the right plan, put on the right amount of muscle and learn how to eat correctly, you'll never need another plan. Dustin, any final thoughts on that module? No, that was excellent. I, I would just say, guys, remember that muscle is the most metabolically active. It uses more calories than any other tissue. You need to do first and foremost over everything else. Add more muscle to your system. Hey, guys, I'm Alan Branch from Project 49. Thanks for looking into our program. I wanted to take a second and go over sort of what makes Project 49's program different than many of the exercise and fitness programs that you see out there. People over 40 have a problem, and the problem is the gradual onset of age-related muscle loss. The medical term for this is called sarcopenia, and this is one of those things that makes you look, uh, if you notice, you look back at pictures of yourself, maybe when you're in your 20s and 30s, and compare that to your 40s and 50s, and you just don't have the same posture and vigor that you had when you were younger, even though you may be trying to eat right and you may be trying to do exercise, but you're doing the wrong type of program. Every program for people over 40 ought to be focused on lean muscle mass. That's going to require a certain type of meal plan, the right nutrients, and the right type of training that is safe and doesn't damage your joints. We also recommend the program being simple, something easy to follow, not a ton of complicated exercises. And once you learn the right way to train and you're over 40 years old, you put the meal plan, the nutrition, and the recovery aspect together, and it's like magic regardless of the age that you are. I'm Alan Branch from Project 49. We specialize in coaching people over age 40 who want to get in great shape. They want to protect their joints. They don't want to ache every day when they get out of bed. They just want to be stronger. They want to be leaner, and they want to do it without spending too much time in the gym. Well, so thanks for checking it out. Look forward to meeting you. Click the link down below. Get signed up for the 49-day, seven-week program, and we'll see you on the other side. Thanks. Mm -hmm.